Hello once again YouTube, it's Callum here from the Andrew Thermanon, and today I'm going to teach how to make a mega safe nuke. Yeah, I know I've already done a video on this before, but uh, this is a more compact version with a lot less materials used. So uh, I guess let's begin. First of all, you're going to need all of the stuff that's in this chest. You're going to need some ice, an energy condenser, collector, so two collectors, ten solar panels, two battery boxes, one retriever, one timer, two nuclear reactors because, you know, you need to put one on top of the other to make it float, six reactor chambers, some ice, two pieces of insulated cable, one HP transformer, one glass fiber, and one NFSU. So then to start off with, you're just going to want to place the condenser here with two of those there like that, like that, like that, that, like that, and like that. So that's the collector, collector, condenser, bat box, retriever, bat box. Very simple. Now then, you're just going to want to start pumping some power into these puppies because, you know, who, uh, who doesn't, you know? Now you're just going to want to make this thing float like that, like I said. You could obviously just use a dirt block or something if you're in survival, but I'm just lazy, you know what I mean? Now then, you're just going to want to take the HV cable out like that. Now we can delete 99% of this stuff. Um, I'm on creative, god damn it. And then you just want to go the transformer with the three pins pointing towards the nuke, and then an MFSU with the one dot pointing away from the nuke. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is basically the super nuke done and dusted. All you need now is to just get under here. Just sneeze, sorry though. Um, <laughs> um, I'm going to get under here, place the timer, and then uh, go into your nuke and just start placing uranium. Now, like the last model, of course, this one can be filled to halfway. So if we just do that right now. And voila! There you go. Now producing insane amounts of power.